So here is a very, very, very big claim from a legacy automaker who is, well, yeah, making some really controversial, bizarre, and maybe almost schizophrenic comments of late. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the Electric Viking. My name is Sam Evans. I'm coming to you here from Melbourne, Australia. Welcome to all you new subscribers. Welcome back to everyone else. Hello to everyone at Eastfield BMX Club. Great to have you here watching the channel. Now, what's going on with Stellantis? Well, Stellantis yesterday, the CEO, Carlos Tavares, said the following. We can't make EVs affordable. They're going to cost twice as much as gas vehicles. Can't see how we can make this work. If everyone moves to EVs, then we're dead in the water. And then today, he says something very different. Today, he claimed that their Ram 1500 electric pickup truck will lead the market in range, towing, payload, and charging speed, according to his internal benchmarking tests. So, yeah, take that with a grain of salt. Honestly, I think this story is a load of bollocks. But if it's true, I would be more than happy to be proven wrong. You know why? I really like Ram. I don't know why. It's weird. I don't, it doesn't make sense. They're doing jack all in terms of electrification of their pickup trucks because, to be honest, they're way behind everyone else. As far as we know, they're way behind. But that said, I've always had a bit of a soft spot for Ram pickup trucks. And I don't know why. There's just something about them that appeals to me. So if they can actually electrify the Ram 1500, meaning it's going to be a way better vehicle, and they can make it lead the market in range, towing, payload, and charging speed, pretty much everything that matters, that's, yeah, that's the full list. That's everything that matters. Then, well, I will be mind blown. And I'll be more than happy, seriously. But yeah, call me skeptical. Now, during Stellantis' Dare Forward 2030 presentation, CEO Carlos Tavares, who is bipolar, by the way. Well, I don't know if he is really, but he seems like he is. Provided a few exciting teasers about the capabilities of the company's upcoming Ram 1500 electric pickup truck. While the Ram 1500 electric will be a bit late to the electric pickup game, the Stellantis CEO stated that the wait for the vehicle is going to be well worth it. And, well, truthfully, the fact is, if they can manufacture them, people will buy them. Because the reality is, there is about 1.6 million pre-orders for electric pickup trucks in the US. And it's going to take years for manufacturers to fulfill those orders. In other words, Ram will have every part. I mean, that they'll be able to sell every single vehicle they can make. Tavares stated that the Ram 1500 electric is expected to come into the pickup truck market in 2024. By that time, the segment will likely be populated by some of Ram's traditional competitors, like the Chevy Silverado EV, which, by the way, is a very impressive pickup, the Ford F-150 Lightning, the Rivian R1T, and of course, the Tesla Cybertruck should be ramped up by then as well. By the way, I made a video yesterday about the Cybertruck's actual dimensions. There's been a lot of conjecture, a lot of um, posturing about what the size is actually going to be. Is it going to be smaller? Is it going to be a uh, different shape? Are they going to rah, 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 rah? Anyway, check out the video I made. I'll put a link in the description below. You can see the actual size of the pickup truck of the production version, so you'll get a good idea of it. Despite this, the Stellantis CEO stated that the Ram Electric will set itself apart from the competition by leading in the metrics that customers care for the most and generally being the best battery electric pickup truck on the market, period. Now, Tesserati says, let me show a glimpse of what else is to come, something we are all very proud of. Our Ram 1500 electric is coming to the hot pickup market in 2024. According to our internal performance index, our Ram 1500 will outperform all competitors on the attributes customers care about, range, towing, payload, and charging time. Now, the fact that he used the proviso, according to our internal index, it does make me question what that really means. He goes on. It's built on top of our new STLA frame architecture designed specifically for full-size electric vehicles. Make no doubt, we will bring the best electric truck to the full size segment and Ram will continue delivering fully electrified solutions to the majority of its segment by 2025 and a full portfolio of electrified solutions for all of its segments no later than 2030. The Stellantis CEO didn't provide any previews of the Ram 1500 electric specs, though his statement hints that this vehicle is going to be insane. I mean, if this actually is what he says it is, 
if it leads in charging, range, performance, towing, everything, I don't know how this is even possible because if you think about it, none of these companies are leading in one area there. They're all doing one thing you know, or a couple of things really well. But if it actually leads in every metric, I don't know how that's possible, but it'll be insane. I mean, it's got to have to be faster than three seconds from zero to 62 miles an hour. That's already supercar speed. How do you make a, a vehicle 3,000 tons go faster than three seconds from zero to 62 miles an hour? That's insane. I mean, imagine sitting in one of these behemoths and going that fast. That would scare the pants off you but it'd be a lot of fun. So rivals such as the Tesla Cybertruck have been announced with some impressive specs, such as towing capacity of 14,000 pounds. It's gonna to have to tow more than 14,000 pounds. Payload capacity of three and a half thousand. It's gonna to have to have more than three and a half thousand pounds of payload. I mean, that's 1,700 kilos just in the tray. Both Rivian and Chevy have announced that their respective pickup trucks, the R1T and the Silverado EV, will have a range of up to 400 miles per charge. And the Cybertruck in its quad motor variant apparently will have a range of 500 miles. So, I mean, Tavares is saying that the 1500 electric will have a range of greater than 500 miles. That is insane. And I hope it's true. If it is, they most certainly will have a winning vehicle on their hands that everyone will want. The competition is fierce, he said, and we are ready to take on the fight for the top spot. Yes, rest assured, when we put the Ram badge on our electric pickup truck, it will be something our customers will be proud of.